Happy holidays, everybody, and welcome to a day in the office. I don't think I read what it was about. Uh, it's too dark to see anything. Oh, we gotta find a light switch. Exit to office. Clock. A clock! Useful for checking how much time has passed. My hands aren't moving. Oh. Okay, well, I guess there's just no light at all. Hello? Oh, hi! Who are you? You're a big guy. Oh! My dearest apologies, I must have forgotten to turn the lights on. I assure you that none of our employees work in the dark. Anyways, my name is Clockheart. <laughs> I'm the CEO of this company, Kronos Inc. Since it's your first day here, I'd like for you to get settled in. Rock around, walk around and take some time to introduce yourself to your coworkers. And if you have any questions, I'll be in my office. Are we just not gonna question the fact that you have a clock for a head? Is... Okay. Bye, I guess. The clock used for checking how much time has passed. The hands aren't moving. Okay, well. Let's go look for our coworkers. Hello. Simone. I'm Simone. Nice to meet you. I hope you enjoy your job here. Working at Cronus is an amazing opportunity. If you got any questions, feel free to ask. Uh, what's your work schedule? We work on Monday to Thursday. Friday is our day off, so no one's around that day. That's pretty good. On Thursday, we have a little potluck where everyone brings some food to share. Ooh. I want to ask you another question. Uh, don't you think our boss looks funny? I mean, he has... Don't be rude. You shouldn't judge us based on their appearance. He has a clock for a head. What do you mean, don't judge based off appearances? He's a... He's a clock! <laughs> Whatever. Did, why does this coworker not have a name? Ugh. Mondays. I really hate Mondays. Come talk to me another day, yeah. Alrighty then. Keypad. It's a keypad that opens the elevator. The elevator is broken. Oh, okay. Hello, Mr. Technician. The elevator is broken, so I got called in for a fix. I'm missing a sol soldering iron, though, and I need it. I, I hope that's how you pronounce that. <laughs> I ordered one a while ago, but it's not coming until tomorrow. Some delivery, eh? What was that accent I just did? Oh, wait, look outside. It's a sunny day outside. Okay. What do I do, then? I talk to everybody. The clock hand still hasn't moved. Oh. Did you get yourself acquainted with the other employees? Simone is one of our long-standing members. She's a valuable asset to our team. I'm sure she's got plenty of stories to share, if you're interested in that sort of thing. I guess so. Bulletin board. It's Monday. Pick up pin. Drop. Okay. Wait, what did that do? Excusez-moi? There's a box sitting on the table. Though curiosity piques you, you feel that it would be rude to open a package meant for someone else. Open the box? Yes. You open the box and find a saw, a saw, or an iron. I don't think we're gonna get that right. <laughs> it's blazing hot outside. Weird. Okay, so we changed the day. It's really hot out today. We used to have a water cooler, but we had an accident involving it. Someone spilled the water over a bunch of equipment and short-circuited all of it. I think something even exploded. Wow. It was actually a pretty scary moment. Malfunctioning equipment is no joke. Clockar was really mad that day. I'd imagine so. He just talked to you today. Man, I'm real thirsty. Hmm? Do you need some? How about you fetch me some water? Then we can talk, yeah? Alright. Uh, I've got... Oh. He's not here. Okay, let's go change it back to Monday, then. It sure is hot outside today. 
We used to have a water cooler, but one of our employees made it explode and damage the office equipment. How did they make the water cooler explode? I, I shouldn't question this. <laughs> Needless to say, he is uh, no longer with us. Hmm. I don't like when you said. I don't know. I, I think it might be the fact that you have a clock for a head, but I don't like when you say sentences like that. <laughs> All right, let's go give the technician. Yeah, the technician his uh thing. Soldering iron is getting here tomorrow. I'm gonna be off the rest of the week though. So unless you can go into the future and get me a soldering iron, this elevator won't be fixed till next week. I have it right here. You give the soldering iron to the technician. Hey, you found a soldering iron. I guess I won't be needing that delivery after all. It's still gonna take a few days to get this elevator up and running, but this will make it a lot easier. My guess is I'll be done by Friday. Thanks for the help. But Friday's the day off. Okay, so we did Monday and Tuesday. Let's go change it to Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday. Ooh, it's dark. Is it storming? It's storming outside with an immense amount of rain. Someone apparently forgot to close the windows. Oh. Hello. I love rainy days. As a kid, I used to stick my tongue out and drink as many raindrops as I could. Okay. It's not as efficient as drinking water normally, but it was a lot more fun. Unfortunately, this rainstorm brought a power outage with it. I was working overtime, but I'm staying here a little longer to enjoy the storm. Okay. This isn't fixed. Um... Is there a, Can we close the windows? Nasty storm out there, isn't it? Fortunately, we have a backup power generator. Unfortunately, there's only enough power for this very room. Wow, really? That's convenient. Let's change it to Thursday. Food! It's a sunny day outside. Food! There's a wide variety of food and snacks. Within the feast, there are two empty water bottles tucked away in a corner. You take the water bottles, but they're empty. How are we supposed to refill it? Happy food day! I brought sandwiches and snacks for today. Feel free to take what you want from the table. Thank you, Simone. Simone always brings a lot of grub on food day. Honestly, I think she does a little too much around here. Well, that's not really a flaw, is it? Being too nice? I mean, it depends on who you ask. Me? I'm just here for my paycheck. I like you, man. <laughs> the elevator's not operational. Okay. How do we fill up the bottles? Because there's no... Wait, the window was open on Wednesday? Yes, yeah, so we can put these outside and collect the water. You stick the water bottles outside and let them fill up with rainwater. Yes! Okay. So let's go back to Tuesday. I don't know if help giving him water will do anything, but why not, you know? It's nice, it's nice to be nice. We have two as well. Can we give one to Simone too? Or is he going to take both? Here you go. You hand him one of the water bottles. Yeah, yeah, I got another one. Hey, you actually got it. Thanks, man. You have no idea how much I needed this. I appreciate it. Really. Hey. I know I was kind of a jerk earlier, so I'll let you in a little secret. It's about the company we're working for. Kronos. Ooh. You know we're supposed to be a consulting firm, yeah? Well, we haven't had any clients for a while now. Don't know how long it's been since our last one. It's hard to keep track of time sometimes. All I know is, for some reason, companies just stop seeing us. And you know what's even weirder? Somehow our boss keeps finding work for us. A consulting firm without any clients should be dead in the water. But we're still getting paid. I ain't complaining, but frankly it's starting to weird me out. That is weird. 
Anyways, that's the office gossip. I'm leaving the company soon, so might as well get it out. Just gotta send the boss my two weeks notice this Friday, and then this stuff will be behind me. If you wanna know more, you can try asking Simone about it. She's been here longer than I have. Take care, man. Oh. Hi, did you need something? What's that? You want me to know- you want to know more about our clients? Truth be told, we haven't had any new ones for a while. Maybe Clockheart's moving the company in a new direction. Although... Hey, is it okay if we talk about this later? I don't really want to talk about it with the others around. If you can meet me sometime when we'll be all alone, I'll tell you more. Things are getting interesting. Okay, so let's go to Thurs... No, not Thursday. Wednesday. I like this mechanic of moving the um, pin around so that the days change. It's interesting. I can't remember the last time I, I played a game that was like this. I always found thunderstorms to be oddly calming. We didn't come here to enjoy the storm, right? Somehow we're still working even though we have no clients. In fact, every day is just a constant stream of work. I can feel each day pass by. I know when it's a new day, but I don't remember leaving this building. Oh. Wait. Sounds crazy, right? How can I not how can I not remember my life outside of work? Anyways, I asked Clockheart about the client thing before. He would always just give me this really weird stare, then walk away. So one day I snooped around his office when he wasn't there, and I found this. Simone hands you a newspaper. I... I don't know what to make of this. But you're a new face here. Maybe you can figure out what's going on. If you could do that and tell me, I'd be really grateful. Kronos Inc. gone. On May 27th, Kronos Inc. filed for bankruptcy. Shortly after, the company's 87 employees, including its CEO, mysteriously vanished. Their whereabouts are still unknown. Attempts to enter the building... Wow. That's so weird. Hey, man. May 27th. Today is important somehow. Let's go to Friday. Hey, man. Yes. What does this company do? Kronos Inc. is a consulting firm renowned by many companies around the world. By solving our clients' past problems, we ensure that future ones don't occur. I assure you that working here is an excellent opportunity. However, there's always lots of work to do, so it's quite easy to lose track of time. So if you need to remind yourself of the date, just look at where the pin is on the calendar. Okay. Why are there only five days on the calendar? Studies show that a four-day work week increases employee morale and productivity. So I, I implemented a schedule where employees get Friday off, in addition to the weekends. I like that. You might be some kind of weird, evil creature, Mr. Clockheart, but the four-day work week... You got some going there. <laughs> Unfortunately, it was starting to cut into our profit, so I had to get rid of Saturday and Sunday. Okay. Pretty billion, right? So you get one day off a week? Okay. Bye, Mr. Clockheart. Hello? The elevator has to be unlocked first. It's a keypad that opens the elevator. It needs a four-digit number. Four-digit. May 27th. January, February, March, April, May. 0527. The elevator unlocks. Yes! I knew it. Take the elevator? Yes. Hello? Oh, I can just hold it. Okay. Damaged equipment. <gasps> Who is this? 
There's a dead bi body lying down on the ground. It's all bloodied and bruised up. You check the body for its contents. You find a two weeks note. It's the dude who was gonna leave the job! Mr. Clockhart, please accept this letter as my formal notice of resignation from Kronos Inc. I'm very grateful for my time here. I hope that this two-week notice is enough time to find a replacement. Thank you for the opportunity to work here. I see. Hi, Mr. Clockhart. How you doing, man? Uh... You shouldn't have come here. I just wanted to check it out. I suppose you found out the fate of my company. That Kronos went bankrupt because a foolish intern damaged the systems. Oh. Systems that happen to hold all of our crucial files. If you think I'm going to let my company die because of some stupid intern's blunder, you are sorely mistaken. And all of the news that reported the bankruptcy are mistaken too. Because as long as I live, Kronos lives, lives forever. But as for you, your time is finished. Uh, uh, water! Did we do it? Walking away. <laughs> Damn, it's all broken down. Who's this? It's a decaying body, rotten and old. There's a name tag next to it. So no, not Simone. Oh, I liked her. Man. A day in the office. Damn, dude. I like Simone. Simone was a cool person. She was actually really helpful. Alright, well, we have time for one more game. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to Blackout. Uh, I also did not read the, strip the description of this game, but... We're a little witch. That's just kind of... In this haunted house, I think is what it is. Or a normal house? I have no idea. Ow. I hit my head. Where am I? What? Who am I? Oh. It's a broom. It's locked. Okay, where's the key? No. I hate ladders. I think. Okay, well... Vines are climbing the wall. Pretty. Okay. Can we pick up the broom? Did I fly here on this? We we don't know who we are. We immediately think we're a witch. <laughs> okay. Ah. Hey, what's that? I bet this unlocks the door. Skull key. Is that a skull key? Because it came out from underneath the skull. It fits. Because if it is, that's hilarious. Oh. Is that a corpse? Maybe. <laughs> An ashtray? Ugh. Bed smokers. There's something under the, under the sheets. What is this? Cigarettes! I'll find some use for them. Okay. Well, goodbye, corpse. We're just gonna keep going. <laughs> Here's another one. <gasps> Kitty! Ah! Hi! What is that thing? It's a cat, you dongus. Talk about menacing venison. That's so stupid. <laughs> That's a snake. I love snakes. Is that a snake? Yes. What a messy bed. Fancy skylight. 
It is kind of fancy, isn't it? Can I pick this up? There's something up there. Can we not grab it? What are these little figurines? Okay, then. Look at this guy in the corner. Oh, hello. Is that us? We're so pretty. I look terrible. Oh. <laughs> Never mind, I guess. <laughs> Imagine spending five nights with this thing. But, bruh, all my homies spend five nights with Freddy's. <laughs> I've never actually played the game. I've played bits of, um, whatever the new one is. It's an unfinished portrait. What is- god damn it, now I can't remember what it's called. SECURITY BREACH! That's what- oh my god. Here you go. Goodbye, kitty. That solves that problem. I don't know why it took me so long to figure out what the name of that game was. Uh, more cigarettes. Ah, ashtray. Yeah, I played up to, I think, the daycare part of Security Breach. I never finished it. I also don't own the game. My friend owns the game and he lets me use his Xbox account to play it. It's a grandfather clock. But I never got past the daycare part. Every time it would switch to nighttime, I just, I couldn't do it. I tried. <laughs> Like, I would- I could know where everything is, but I'd always get caught. There's something crinkly inside. It contains an assortment of vials. What were they cooking in here? Food? There's something in that jar. Do I need to get a stool again? Oh my god. Yeah, secure- I guess like half of Security Breach is the only FNAF game I have ever played. And I, I enjoyed Security Breach, and despite it, I didn't finish it, sure. You're my favorite stool. It is my favorite stool. I mean, yeah, I didn't finish it, but I still enjoyed it. Uh, I watched Markiplier's videos on it. And then I watched Markiplier play the DLC. Please don't break. It's a very interesting game. Beef jerky. Score. <laughs> sure. My best friend in the world. <laughs> There's a note taped to the fridge. You gonna read it? It's too dark to read. Okay. Hello? Brr. It's cool down here. I have a bad feeling about this. Ah, what the f- Ugh. What is that thing? No, I don't want to die. Okay, we're leaving. Bye. Ugh. I like how it stopped outside the darkness. Hi, friend. Hey. H hello Nicotine. What? You heard me. Okay. You can have these cigarettes. Lighter. I don't have a lighter. Do I really gotta find you a lighter? That's one ugly mug. And it's my it's new owner. Lucky me. <laughs> I like this character. <laughs> this is how I would act in this situation. <laughs> it's a corpse. I think I've become desensitized by now. You've seen one other corpse. <laughs> Can't even remember my own phone number. Toilet paper. The door is taped shut. Oh. Okay, so we need scissors. Oh, is that a corpse? Drink. Bathtub. I think it's thirsty. I think you're going in an it. <laughs> Whoa! That has to be the biggest adder cop I've ever seen! Is that a type of spider? A drawer. The trash can is empty. Can I turn on this light? I flicked the switch. Nothing happened. Okay, well... We're just back here. 
Uh, wait, hold on. Uh, we got the mug, the stool, and the jerky. Can we give the <laughs> can we give the beef jerky to the creature in the basement? <laughs> What's up, man? Have some jerky. No thanks. I'm vegan. Oh. Well, can I use a stool here? Perhaps I can scare it off. I need something to scare it off. Oh. Can we take the crowbar? A crowbar! But it will come in handy. Nice. Can we use, um... Can we use this on the bathroom door? I can't peel the tape off. Okay, what about this thing? It's a vent. It's a vent. Okay. Duel. Move. It's an empty beer can. I don't want the mug. I want the stool. Okay, apparently I can't do that. I need a lighter. An impossible bottle. Prime Day Edition. I don't know what to do. Oh wait, there's a lighter. It's a lighter! I guess I'll take it. Yeah! Let's go give it to this weird killer guy. I don't know if this is a costume or if he actually has a knife in his head, but I'm gonna assume it's a costume. Thanks. Yeah, it's a costume. Here. Thanks, man. Is he gonna- <laughs> Don't smoke indoors! Why are you like this? <sighs> Whatever. Never smoke indoors, by the way. Cigarette or vape, never do that. That is horrible, not only for yourself and your house, but also for anybody that's ever going to visit or is already around you. Take her for somebody who has been around smokers for most of his life. Tap straight out. Yuck, that's dirty. Looks like someone died here. I just realized, why do you want bathtub water? I know this scene. This is the part where I open the curtains and <laughs> reveal the killer. Phew. Gross. Ah! A tub monster! <laughs> Called it. <laughs> Hi. No. If it grabs me, I'm a goner. Do you want the jerky? Okay, apparently it did. What just happened? Thank you, I guess? Well, whatever it is. It's in the mug now. Perfect. My very own chalice. Chalice of malice. <laughs> is this me? <laughs> am, am I this character? <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Alright, here's your mug, man. Thanks. Take this. Good night. A key? For what? Old key. Was there anything to unlock? The handle is missing. Crowbar. Hmm. It's a note! What's it say? 0346 Is there like a safe around here? Also, what do I use the key for? I haven't seen anything that needs to be unlocked. It's a framed wedding photo. What's that behind it? Oh! Star 0346 Whatever the symbol is. Is that a Kermit mask? What a creepy mask. Well, I guess that's mine now. It's- it says monster- it's Kermit! Look at it, it's Kermit! <laughs> I like that, that's funny. 
feel the power of my mask. <laughs> yeah. Booga booga. That's right. Later. I scared her off. I think I'm done with this. No, keep it on. It's funny. Aww. What's this? There's a hole in the wall. There's something typed at the freezer. It's some sort of note. What is that sound? 0650. I think the clock face is open. The door is locked though. Key for the door. Grandfather clock is an old key. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. 065. What is it? The little hand is the hour big hand is 0650. This should be right, shouldn't it? Is that the clock? Oh, oh, I have to click off of it. There we go. It worked! Hello? Whoa! There's something inside. Is it the cat? No way. I won't open it. Why? Whatever. Hello? Oh my god, is this what I think it is? Hi! So sorry we started without you. Hey, Marilyn. Are you feeling better yet? Whoa, this dude's tripping! Look at him go! What are you doing? Why? Okay. Oh, you're just asleep. Seems like the party derailed while we were preparing the ritual. It's a Halloween party. She's sleeping in a pool of wine. Who was in the bathroom? Ugh. He's gonna be hung over. Yuck. It's full of... Let's move on. Ew. Why did you drink that? Thanks for the drink. Tastes kind of funky though. I wonder why. You freak. Hello. You're not on the floor anymore. Hey. Did we. Ha! <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Definitely not, man. No. I have to go. No. I have to go. What do you mean you have to go? Oh my god. The seance was a failure. This is the last time I rely on children to perform a ritual. Two weeks of acting. Oh my god. All for nothing. Oh well. There's always next year. Time to leave. We're an actual witch. Dude. <laughs> 
<laughs> I love that. That is so cool. <laughs> that was Blackout. <laughs> I think we're gonna leave it at only two games. <laughs> if you enjoyed watching, please make sure to like and subscribe if you don't want to. That is perfectly fine. You're not obligated to. You're all very beautiful, and I will see you all next time. Bye bye. Go ahead and run the outro so I can do do something else. <laughs> bye bye.